I'll walk you through a little progressive muscle relaxation exercise today, just to give you a sense of what that might be like. Let's start by just noticing how our body feels right now. Noticing any tension or tightness or sensation we feel throughout our body. We can start at the top of our head and check in with our neck and shoulders, our stomach, our hips, our legs, and our feet. And just notice anything we're experiencing right now before we begin. Then in order to start our progressive muscle relaxation, we're gonna be tensing certain parts of our bodies as hard as we can for a few seconds. And then we're gonna release that tension and just notice how it feels to have that part of our body feel more relaxed. To start, we're going to do our feet. And we're gonna tense our feet as hard as we can for six seconds and release. Ready and go. And release. Take a breath. We're gonna move slightly upwards and we're going to do our calves next. Same thing, we're gonna tense our calves as hard as we can for about six seconds and then we'll release. And release. Again, take a breath. The next thing we'll do is we'll do our thighs or our quads. Again, tensing, holding, and then releasing. And release. The next thing we're going to do is our abs or our stomach. Again, tensing and releasing. We'll do this for about six seconds. And release. Take a nice breath. Let it go. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna move outwards a little bit and we're going to do our hands. So we're gonna tense our hands, maybe ball them into fists as hard as we can. And then we'll release. And release. Maybe wiggle your fingers. Notice that relaxation. Next, we'll do our arms. So you can do your forearms, you can do your biceps, you can do both, whatever feels good to you. Tense our arms. And release. Take a breath. You're doing great so far, just a few left. Next thing we'll do is we'll do our shoulders. So to do these, you can either push them up towards your ears to tense them. You can push, push your shoulder blades back and together. Or if you love it, you can do both. But we're going to start with our shoulders tensing and then releasing. And release. Take a pause and breathe. Next, we're gonna do our face. This one's a little silly, but we're gonna try to tense everything in our face as hard as we can all at once. So we're gonna tense our jaw, our eyes, our eyebrows, our mouth, our lips, all together, tensing our face as hard as we can. Again, release. Doing super great. The last thing we're gonna do today is the silliest thing we've done yet, but we're going to try to tense our whole body as hard as we can all at once. So everything from our toes to our calves, to our thighs, our stomach, our abs, our shoulders, our face, all at once as hard as we can. Six seconds and then release. Ready and 
go. And release. Take a sigh, let it out. Notice how your body's feeling. Do a quick body scan again now that we've finished checking in with your head and your shoulders, your neck. Moving down into your ribs and your stomach. Hips, legs, knees, feet, toes. Noticing now that we've completed this, anything that feels positive, negative, or neutral. Any parts of your body that feel better, worse, or the same. And then whenever you're ready, we can invite ourselves to come back to the present moment. If you've had your eyes closed, you can open your eyes a little bit more. Let some more light in. Maybe wiggle your fingers or your toes and reorient back to the space. If you found this exercise helpful, this is something that I invite you to use in any way that's helpful to you. So you can do it sitting, you can do it laying down, you can do it before bed, you can do it in the middle of the day, at your desk, whatever feels good to you. There's no right or wrong. You might find that you enjoy doing this whole exercise from your feet all the way to your head and then doing your whole body. However, you don't have to go through this whole thing if you don't feel the need to. You might find that you enjoy just doing your hands, even while you're out and about throughout your day. Maybe you do your feet and your legs. Maybe you find that you do the whole thing, but you hold it for 10 seconds instead of six. There's no wrong way. It's just whatever you find helpful whenever you find it helpful.